Hey everybody, this is LaCora Stevens with The Yes Show, Young, Entertaining, and Saved. I am at NRB in the city of Anaheim. NRB, you don't know what it is? It is the National Religion Broadcast Conference that they have annually. And this has been about 10 or 12 years that they've had it here in California. So it is lit. Okay, well, it's not lit, but it's more lit than what it normally is. <laughs> and I'm here to give you guys my review, my takeaway. Okay, I came here as press to review, and I have some great takeaways for you. Takeaway number one is that NRB had some great panelists. They had this remarkable session called Pitchathon, where regular people like you or me could come in for five minutes and pitch 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 to people like pure flicks right isn't that pretty dope that's amazing um, so you could literally sit face to face with five minutes showcasing your idea okay so I thought that that was remarkable a second a remarkable um, component to this was the the realness of having CEOs and owners of networks available and accessible to your face like they will come on a panel give you some great knowledge and then at the end talk to you speak with you wait around for you that does not happen all the time so I thought that that was great um, and one thing that I learned from the panel is that people like Hulu Amazon Google Apple Plus um, Netflix that they are seeking Christian content movies they are seeking them because they want to say hey we're the ones we're over here we have the Christian audience and viewers like they are looking because of course viewership adds up to money so they want to be able to say that we are the top provider for Christian content so I thought that that was pretty cool another takeaway from the panel is that um, they are looking on how to digitize how to go with the future of media a lot of these things are on Instagram Facebook things like that in the Christian world of media is looking to make room for that space how can we be a part of that what can we do differently so I thought that that was cool where can we have improvement uh, now remember this is just my review biggest thing uh, lack of diversity NRB if you are listening come here can we talk can we really talk? I don't know if anyone told you this or not, but we need to have more diversity. We need to see more black people. We need to see more brown people. We just need to see more people other than white people. Now, that's not throwing shade or anything. That's just the reality of it. And by the way, I'm LaCora Stevens. Uh, so I'm not trying to say, oh, I'm hiding behind anything and I'm throwing shade. No, absolutely not. We are all God's people and all God's people look very, very different. And that needs to be a reflection here at the conference, uh, not only from the people coming here, but from your vendors, from the panelists that you have speaking. Uh, we can't just put one black person and say, hey, there's a diversity. That's not so, okay? Yes, Devon Franklin drew me in this year, and I wanted to learn more about it. However, I have a friend who used to serve on the board, and same complaints, lack of diversity. It ha we have to do better, NRB. NRB, we have to do better. Yeah, can repeat with me. LaCora, we are going to do better with diversity are going to do better with diversity. Thank you. I appreciate that. Um, and not just diversity of color, but also within age. Okay, there are millennials out there. They are, they want Christian content. They want it. They are creating Christian content. Try something different. Scour YouTube. Look for things. Try to put them on your network. Okay, that's my advice to you. Uh, now, the second thing I noticed, my opinion, once again, church culture. We, we're supposed to be set apart, man. We are supposed to love each other, treat each other, you know, love thy neighbor, love each other. But I, I'm not feeling that, not getting that, not seeing that. Maybe that's just my experience from who I am. But I'm going around saying hey to people. Hi. Barely getting eye contact. Folks looking down. We are set apart. Or are we? Are we? Because I'm coming here and it seems like some regular old worldly convention that I'm used to going to anywhere else. There, nothing has been set apart. And if we are part of this cult, this church culture, 
And we are supposed to preach the gospel. That's the theme, Proclaim 19, where they are looking at, you know, Psalms. I think it's 134. Let me, let me, I don't want to tell y'all the wrong thing. Uh, Psalms 145, verse 4. Proclaim 19. And it says, one generation will declare your words to the next and will proclaim your mighty acts. Well, I, I, I don't, I don't know. I, I just, I don't know. So the church culture is lacking. And it's so crazy because I was having a, a personal conversation with my friend that we're both here covering. And I was like, man, this church culture, I just, I don't like it. It just, it's so blah. It's like there's no love. And this older Caucasian gentleman hurt me. He was like, yeah, unfortunately, it's just like a business, huh? I said, yeah, it is. Now, two different races, genders, but yet here we are agreeing. Something is wrong with that. Let's fix that. Let's show each other some love. We're supposed to be set apart. We're Christians, right? We love each other, right? Or do we? Because we don't look alike. What is it really? get down to that NRB. Think about it, talk about it, work on it, and let's see some growth for your 76 NRB conference. Yeah? Yeah. All right, everyone. This is LaCora Stevens with the Yes Show, Young, Entertaining, and Safe. And that has been my review, my personal review of NRB, along with my takeaways. I hope you enjoyed it. If so, please thumbs up, comment, tell me your thoughts if you have ever been, and go ahead and hit those notifications because on my channel, I have web series, I have segments, I have talk shows, celebrity interviews. Go on and check it out, okay? All right, you guys, this is LaCora Stevens signing off from Anaheim at NRB, and I will talk to y'all later. Bye.